Hi guys, this is Derek with Automatic Door and Hardware. Today, we're gonna to be wiring in um, the uh, A100 series uh, receiver into the Maverick EZ4000 unit. Um, so, uh, reason you, you get the A100s is um, this customer went with the um, California um, plates, which are 36 inches tall. Um, and they will only work with the A100 series receiver. So um, what I'm gonna do here, uh, so I have my, my radio harness, which is a three wire harness. I've already stripped the contacts I need. So it's a bit confusing on, on this unit. Um, you'll see that I only have three wires stripped. We don't use green on this harness. Um, on the receiver, when you get it out of the box, you can see same colors, um, but they don't correspond to the same things. Um, because we already have our own harness, we're gonna go ahead and remove these wires. Um, so I'm gonna just remove these here. Okay, there we go. Um, so first, we're gonna go to power. So red is gonna be power on this. And I always like to twist these beforehand so that you don't have any stray strands shorting on anything. So, okay. so we're gonna go red to the first terminal, which is labeled 1224. We're gonna tighten it. Tighten it down. Okay, give it a little tug to make sure it's seated. Um, next, we are going to actually make a jumper. So from the wire we just pulled out, I'm gonna take a black, the black, and I'm gonna cut a little jumper out. And we are going to strip the other side. Uh, twist this, and basically make a U. And this is going to jump the next terminal, the next two terminals. Um, and while we're jumping those next two terminals, you're gonna, you're gonna want this to land um, on either either one of those terminals. Let me loosen this up a little bit more. set this one in first and then we are going to put this in next Okay, give it a gentle tug. Make sure you're making good contact and you're not pinching down on the actual wire shielding. And the last one is white and we are gonna go on normally open, N-O. Green is right here is just an antenna. Um, so there we go. I'm gonna use the included Velcro strips here to mount this receiver so that you can it can come out easy. good right there okay and then we're gonna plug this into radio so you'll see it's the first four pin connector next to the three the blue three pin terminal block all right and there we go we're all wired up um, so um, we'll go ahead and get the next video will be us learning the 
36 inch um, actuation bar to this receiver. Um, so stay tuned for the next video, guys. Thank you.